1.9 million. That's the number of new permanent residents that Canada plans to welcome between 2022 and 2025. Hey everyone, it's Curtis and Ash with Royal LePage, Team Realty in Ottawa. In this video, we're gonna talk about immigration and its effect on our housing market. As you probably already know, our country has been dealing with a supply shortage. Of all the countries in the G7, Canada comes in with the fewest units per 1,000 people, which equates to a shortage of about 1.8 million homes. We're also the number one nation in the world where people would most like to live. As of January 2023, Stats Canada estimates that our population is over 39 million people. And that number won't be getting any smaller. The Canadian government has lofty immigration targets over the next three years. This includes 465,000 new permanent residents in 2023, 485,000 in 2024, and 500,000 new residents in 2025. When you couple this with the strong demand from millennials who already live in Canada, the future of the Canadian housing market is going to remain strong. According to a Royal LePage survey among those aged 25 to 35, 4 million Canadian millennials plan to purchase a home over the next five years. And the supply demand imbalance is going to continue to keep the housing prices up. With more immigrants coming to Canada, lack of supply continues to be a concern. It's one reason that the Canadian housing minister told Global News in an end of the year interview that it's quite ironic that Canada needs to welcome immigrants who are skilled tradespeople who can help us build more homes. Although new permanent residents may not immediately impact the demand in the residential resale market, while they get established, within a few years, they'll certainly be looking to enter the housing market. In the short term, rental demand will continue to be strong given the large number of new arrivals to Canada. According to U.S. News Global Survey, Canada is the best country to start a career. In fact, at 60.2%, the vast majority of Canadian immigration is for economic factors, more than four times that of the United States. Canada is also the world's third leading destination for international students. In 2021 alone, there were 621,000 students studying in Canada from abroad. These individuals contribute to $22 billion annually to our economy and may very likely be looking to live and work here after they obtain their degree. On Forbes Global Livability Index, Canada has three cities that rank in the top 10 for best places to live, including Toronto, Vancouver, and Calgary. The city of Ottawa ranked number 7 in the world for work-life balance, according to a survey from Kesey which examined over 130 data points. This included factors such as work intensity, city livability, mental health care, outdoor spaces, and much more. The bottom line is this. People from abroad want to move to Canada, and this will continue to put pressure on our housing market. Over the past three years, average weekly earnings in Canada have gone up by 12%. High paying jobs and good employment benefits make us an attractive option for those looking to raise a family. As previously mentioned, over the next several years, it's clear that Canada plans to significantly bolster immigration in order to strengthen our economy. Which, like I said, the Canadian housing market is going to remain strong. Between first-time millennial homebuyers and rising immigration, the need for entry-level properties will be in high demand. According to another Royal LePage 2023 market forecast, the aggregate housing price in Canada is expected to drop by just 1% year over year despite the high interest rates and the increased cost of living. We remain hopeful that with interest rates steadying as the year progresses, the stability will prompt buyers and sellers to feel comfortable entering the market. It was also recently announced that in December, Canada's inflation rate eased to 6.3%, its lowest level since February of last year, and perhaps signals a very busy spring market ahead. If you have any questions about buying or selling, or would like to chat about the Ottawa market, please don't hesitate to reach out or visit us online at cernorealty.com to learn more about how we can help you achieve your property goals.